Well, it's that time of year when competitive pumpkin growers really ramp up their games. In Belmont County, the race is coming down to the home stretch because the Barnesville Pumpkin Festival weigh-in is just two days from now. There's a new competitor this year, not an individual, but a group. They are incarcerated adults at the Belmont Correctional Institution. DK Wright went behind the walls for this story, and she's back now and live in the 7 News studio with us. DK. Stephen, that's right. You won't see their faces or hear their voices. That wasn't allowed. But you are about to see what they've worked on every day all summer. The biggest question at the prison these days isn't about the prison. It's about the pumpkin. How much does that pumpkin weigh? Are you going to enter into Circleville? Are you going to enter into Barnesville? The answers are yes, it will be entered in the Barnesville Pumpkin Festival and we're hoping somewhere in that 1400 pound range uh, is our best hope. We don't know for sure until we get it on the scale. They started with five seeds. They all sprouted, but two of the plants didn't thrive. Now they have three plants, each with one pumpkin. They started in the spring with a soil test and seeds from proven giant pumpkins. Between that and uh, the guys taking care of them like they did, they're in the patch every single day. They can't wait to get these things on the, on the scale Wednesday afternoon at Barnesville so we can really find out how much the big pumpkin weighs. They have a very nice pumpkin over here for sure. I'm going to say top 10, potentially top 10 for sure. I was really amazed to come in here and see what I'm seeing today. I come into this place and every day I make a right turn and go check out the pumpkin patch. I yell across, how much does it weigh? <laughs> What are you thinking, fellas? Is it, how much did it grow last night? And, and they usually have a number for me. Prisons can be a drab place. And this has been something that makes everybody smile. These three individuals that's growing this pumpkin are extremely happy. They've gained knowledge through the prison system, through the books. They've read everything that's been handed out and presented to them. They are just absolutely wonderful. And so are their pumpkins. The Way In will be live streamed on Belmont County Tourism Council's Facebook page Wednesday from 6 to 9 p.m. DK Wright live in the 7th studio working for you.